Who invented the first battery, and how did it get to be what we know it as today? This is Avell with batteriesandaflash.com. Most credit goes to Italian physicist Count Alessandro Volta, creating the first true voltaic battery in 1798. Count Alessandro Volta. You have to walk around saying that all the time. In 1938, William Connick made a discovery in Iraq of a five inch pottery jar containing a copper cylinder and encasing it was an iron rod, concluding that he found an ancient battery dating back over 2,000 years ago. According to Energizer's website, several advancements were made since Volta's design. In 1836, just over 38 years since the inception of Volta's design, John F. Daniel developed a method that avoided corrosion plaguing his design. In 1868, George of Clanche designs a wet cell. A wet cell is a battery that has a fluid chemical solution instead of a solid-based chemical compound, or dry cell. The dry cell was invented by Dr. Carl Gassner in 1888, which is similar to today's carbon-zinc batteries. In 1898, the dry cell becomes the energy source for the first electric hand torch, or flashlight. Since then, EverReady and Energizer, once known as National Carbon Company, has led the way into early battery development and advancements bringing to the market the first hearing aid battery, the first commercial watch battery, 9-volt batteries, nickel cadmium batteries, and even the first viable cylindrical alkaline batteries such as the double A's. By far, the most revolutionary advancement are lithium batteries developed in the 1970s by M.S. Whittingham while working for Exxon. The benefits they bring far surpass any of the other chemistries. They are smaller, lighter, can be rechargeable, and are easier to charge. They deliver more power and can do so much more. However, they are also one of the most dangerous of all battery families. Once ignited through shorting or damage, Lithium batteries are considered a runaway battery and cannot be put out. Suppression and controlling the environment are some of the only methods used to contain a lithium battery fire. While batteries have come a long way since their inception, there's always something new to be discovered. And until that technology emerges, continue to enjoy the fun and security they bring to your everyday life. And remember to tune in, charge up, or you just might get left in the dark. Oh!